now. This is the Fox 11 10 o'clock news. It was 10 years ago that the deadly Northridge earthquake rocked Southern California. Today, people remembered its devastating effects while getting prepared in case there's another one. Sam Hall Kaplan has the story. The earth moved and the apartment came apart. <laughs> Ten years ago to the day, Los Angeles was jolted awake by a magnitude 6.7 earthquake. Anybody in here? It was not the strongest or largest earthquake ever to rattle the Southland, but its location was centered beneath the densely populated Northridge. With the result, 57 fatalities, 9,000 injured, and $40 billion in damage. The earth shook again today, but it was localized on the Caltech campus and man-made and instructive. Seismology equipment and a variety of interactive exhibits were on display as part of a one-day event open to the public, which attracted some 500 people. We are trying to make real-world examples of the degree of risk that Californians face here in the Southland. That way they can take the appropriate measures. This included exploring maps to see if you live in an area more prone to earthquake damage. And also learning about simple things you can do to minimize damage such as securing furniture and furnishings with various gels and straps. The theory is, the more you know, the less you fear. And that goes for kids as well as parents. I've lived here all my life in California, and so I've been through uh, many earthquakes. I want to learn more about earthquakes. I always think I'm prepared for earthquakes, but I'm never always sure. Exploring what we know and don't know about earthquakes. On the 10th anniversary of the Northridge earthquake, I'm Sam Hall Kaplan, Fox 11 News.